Hello, I'm Jerry Ford, and we got Jeremy Ford over here, and we are going to review some pig out pork rinds. Um, and this is from the Outstanding Foods Company. Jeremy picked out the nacho cheese to review today. Full of flavor, free of guilt. You don't have to feel guilty about eating these because these things are very healthy. <clears throat> They're plant-based type a pork rind. This is a pigless pork rind, so there's no there's no pork in here. It's all plant-based. You know, peas, um, rice, grits, that kind of stuff. So, uh, <clears throat> let's see what it says back here about the nacho cheese. Or do you think it says it the same thing as it does the original? I'm not sure. <clears throat> I think it's. I think they just put up here which one it is. But it says back here in the back, Outstanding Foods creates snacks that are full of flavor, free of guilt, and crafted by renowned Chef Dave Anderson. Chef Dave transforms wholesome plant-based ingredients packed with protein and health benefits into our addictively delicious pig out pigless pork rinds. Uh, whether you love traditional pork rinds or have never had them, you'll find our pig out pigless pork rinds hella tasty Tear open a bag and pig out. <clears throat> Down below it says, say cheese and smile for the camera when you try our nacho cheese flavor. Take a video of yourself enjoying our pig out pigless pork rinds. Post on Instagram or Facebook and tag us at Outstanding Foods for your chance to win free pork rinds. Cool. Oh, what is, we've got, let's see these ingredients. Okay, got rice, that was in the other one. Mm -hmm. High oleic expeller prep, I'm not, I'm sure I'm not saying that right, but ole, oleic expeller sounds alien, doesn't it? Sounds like you're casting a Harry Potter spell. <laughs> uh, pressed sunflower oil. Got some pea protein, pea grits. Vegan nacho seasoning, pea protein, sea salt, uh, yeast extract, natural flavors, cane sugar, onion powder in this one, um, tomato powder in this one, spices, vinegar powder, white distilled vinegar, garlic powder in this one, mm -hmm. green bell pepper powder in this one, paprika extract, <clears throat> lactic acid, you got some jalapeno pepper in this one. So it's got a lot of different mm -hmm. different uh, flavors to look for. So we're going to see if we can find <clears throat> find all those flavors in it. <clears throat> it has a place you can tear it, but like I always say, I like cutting it. it makes it easier to put a clothespin on it. And uh, sometimes when you tear these bags, they rip all the way down the side. Not not particularly this one, but I've had it happen, so I just don't take a chance to lay anymore. So. Not not a whole lot of aroma, just a a little pork rind. I mean, the plant-based pork rind kind of aroma and very light nacho cheese. Maybe just a little bit of jalapeno powder. See what you get. <clears throat> That's similar to the other one. Yeah. Okay, so. <clears throat> Got some orange powder on there, some nice color. Mm -hmm. Little black, little specks on there. Um, some kind of spices. Maybe it may be jalapeno powder. Mm -hmm. it might be a little pep. You know, the paprika is probably the orange powder, more orange mm -hmm. powder. Thank you, Mama says yes. Yeah, there's a little like a green bell pepper in the powder in there too. Could be. Oh yeah, that's true. <clears throat> I see some little red. See the little red. Flicks in there. Mm -hmm. That could be some of the jalapeno powder. Let y'all get a kind of a look. They look really good. Mm -hmm. 
All right, let's see what we got. Oh, wow. Man, all them flavors just punched me in the face. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Nice, good texture to them, nice and crunchy. Mm -hmm. um, <clears throat> light to medium saltiness. Mm -hmm. You getting any heat? A little bit. Me too. <clears throat> um, a little paprika, a little onion powder, <clears throat> maybe a little tomato powder. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Nacho cheese flavor is there. Um, it's just kind of different. Um, there's a little bit of a ch cheesiness, but it's just not the traditional nacho cheese that she would you, she would get on actual nacho cheese type products. But but it's uh, enough to make it enjoyable. It tastes good. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> The heat that's starting it's building, mm -hmm. um, it's still mild heat, mm -hmm. but it's an enjoyable heat. I like it. Um, very good. Mm -hmm. I like these. Yeah. Well, Chef Dave did a good job on these. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I mean, you can you can get the, you can get the flavors, you can get the rice, you can get the the, the you know the grit, the grits. Um, what was the other thing? Oh, the pea protein. I'm giving the pea protein just a little bit, but the flavors are kind of hiding the mm -hmm. pea, the pea, um, and and that it's plant based. It's kind of hid, but yet you know you still you know you get you get the rice, you get the grits, you you know it's it's obvious. Mm -hmm. um, very good. Mm -hmm. I like it. The heat is still building a little bit more. But it's not getting it's not getting over a medium heat. Mm. It's uh, it's not unbearable. Really good. Okay. Well, we will end it there. Um, where are we at on time? Eight thirty-five. On the first one we did on the original, I read some okay. of the stuff that was on the box. Um, if you're not interested, this is the end of the video. You can fast forward if you want. But I'm going to read this out of, you know appreciation that they sent us it's these i want to give you as much information as possible um it says on the box we're so excited for you to try pig out pigless pork rinds we know you're going to love their bold flavors and crunchy texture and the fact that they're packed with protein and health benefits please share what you think by tagging us in your reaction videos or snacking photos on instagram at outstanding foods um <clears throat> 25 grams of plant-based protein in every full size bag, 76% less sodium and 67% less saturated fat than traditional pork rinds, free from gluten, soy, GMOs, cholesterol, and trans fats, energy rich, good carbs, and baked, not fried. So it's a good product. Mm -hmm. It's a good product. Um, and these days we need to be eating healthy. Um, so that's great that they're able to still send out. Some companies, I've always been questionable about it with, with the virus going on, whether or not 
they can distribute out right now. Some places, some you know, have been closed down. I, I'm, I'm, I'm assuming, you know, because mm-hmm. of the virus. Um, but some people are able to send out from the houses. Um, some do, don't have as many workers um, in their warehouse that they can't just be there and be separated from other people and get their job done. You know, so um, that's cool that they the outstanding foods can still send out. So contact them, um, order some of these. These are good. These are really good. Very addicting. If Jeremy and I didn't, you know, pay attention to what we was doing, we'd end up eating the whole bag and just not even realize what we were doing. They're just, mm-hmm. they're just those, that kind of food. So, okay, well, we're, we'll end it there. We thank you all for watching. We appreciate that. Thank you, Outstanding Foods, for sending these to us to review and we will see you all on the next one we have two more flavors to to review so stay tuned bye